What's up, y'all? Got a banger from Alpha Central. Let's get straight into it. This is just my friend Ryan. Just have a bit oh, we're just friends. I just had a really tough time at, uh, at work. So he's, he's sort of... It's like the text book stuff. He's just a friend. I just had a really hard time at work. It was just uh, it's so hard for me. And you weren't there. And... Yeah, right. Sorry, I, I told you I was at home. I just, I didn't really want to get into it. Are you looking for that guy? Yeah, I know. Wow. I've seen you. She's a runner. She's a track star. Yo, where, where you going, bro? Hey, hey, where you going? Hey, yo, where you going? You've been caught out, man. Johnny. Oi. Where you going? Oh, Johnny boy. <laughs> whose cheeks have you been beating? <laughs> uh, you got. He's, he's literally just We're a co worker. Yeah, he's no. just a friend. Hey, no, come on. He's a co worker. Yeah. Why'd you be down at the beach on a so weekday? Because I'm having Look at him. Why are you guys here? Look at him. Look at him. They're here, they're We're they're here for the, support. Yeah, there's support. So why is he walking away? Just Where leave him out of this. He's in the room. You've been time. caught out. A rough time. Yeah. What rough time? I was having problems at work. Oh, I will say they rolled up deep on this girl. Oh, you just come you. back. Don't, so much better, bro. don't do this. Okay, She's not hot. Come on, bro. Babe. Uh, don't do this. Don't do this. She's like a seven. <laughs> She's like a seven. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. When she get, he's like, uh, she's like a seven, bro. She's a seven, bro. I wouldn't even trip on it. Right. You can be drunk here all you want to. Okay, I'm gonna be real drunk here when my people beat your ass. I'm, I'm fine, fine with that. I'm fine this girl with is barely taller than the freaking doorknob. Talking about somebody gonna whip somebody's ass. <laughs> Honey, stop. You're barely taller than this aquarium. Fired. Or terrarium. I know you'll call the police. I know you call the police. That's what you want me to do. No, that's what you're. That's what you always wanted to do. That's, what that's why I don't need to be with you. That's what you want me to do. Okay. No, I don't want to do that. You told me to call my dad. Yeah, you call told me to call all these people. Yeah, go ahead. I said go ahead and get your money no, so I can go. That's what you told me. To I said all you gotta so do is get your money so I can go. You told me to do. Okay, whatever. You want me to do what you told me to do. All right, whatever. A few moments later. All I'm trying to do is go out the door. Y'all see this on camera. I'm trying to leave out the door, get away from the situation, and make things better for me, but um, I can't seem to uh, go. So when the police get here, you will see, because I'm going to have to remove her from me physically. I'm trying to be polite and just walk out and, and, and have a great day, but um, she won't get off me. Can you please get off me? I'm Gary, asking her twice. I'm asking you to Can sit Can you down. please get off of me? Okay, I'm asking you to sit Can down. Can you please get off of Gary, me? Gary, please don't put your hands. I'm, I'm begging you, please sit down, Gary. Please, please don't leave me. Please. 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 You see this, right? Gary, you see please, this? Please, I'm, trying please, I'm trying to go. Please. I'm trying to go. Look at me. Look at me. She just what? <laughs> look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Oh my God. She was all tough at first, though. Oh, look, another guy sleeping in my girlfriend's bed. Wait, for the third time, bro? Come on. She's a runner, she's a track star. You should have left her after the first. Chat, let me know. Would you, would you, like, forgive a girl if she cheated on you, bro? Men and women cheat for completely different things. Women cheat emotionally, men cheat physically. That's my hot take. And they conked. They knocked and I have out. I have a video, and I'm going to ruin your life. So how do you feel about that? Yeah. How does it feel? <laughs> she doesn't care. I work my off day in and day out. And she's getting her back her back blown out by another man. A hundred really? plus hours a week. And I do nothing. Hundred plus hours a week? Brutal, bro. But be faithful to you. There was plenty of opportunities I could have had. But I said no. And I didn't do it. You're mm. I hope you know that's that. the bottom line. I loved you, Lydia. I did. I go to hell. Bro, she does that not care. That man really playing She does not care. And this dude is just knocked out. Bro, that is 
This man is cooked, working 100 hours a week. You gotta come home to your wife getting her cheeks beat by another man? Come on. I know the dating scene sucks, but so does getting hurt in an accident. Have you ever found yourself involved in a personal injury case? As an image consultant, I meet a lot of clients who are actually recovering from all sorts of injuries, from car accidents to workplace injuries. And I was actually surprised to see at how many people lose their personal injury cases, which is why I wanna talk about Morgan & Morgan, America's largest injury law firm. They specialize in a wide variety of personal injury cases. And they've won thousands of big cases. And if you do end up working with them, they're gonna fight for the money that you deserve. Just recently, Morgan & Morgan solidified verdicts in Florida for $12 million and $26 million in Philly. That's up to 40 times the highest insurance offer. And I'm telling you, your case could be worth millions. And the best part is, it's all free unless you win your case. Now, if you've also been the victim of a personal injury or a serious accident, you can visit www.forthepeople.com slash Levi, found in the description below, where you can start your free claim today. Are you Please, done? tell Are you me finished? something. Please, enlighten me. Okay, give me a second. I will enlighten you. If you're talking about what I think you're talking about, this will clear it up. Sophia, you're drinking with another man in my house when I'm gone. What are you gone. drinking? What are you talking about? I, was I have all the footage, bro. I already showed him everything. I was coughing. So give me a second. This will clear everything up. What are you talking it about? It was a joke. It was a prank. You're just like so heated right now. Now I have to call him and like, this is going to explain it to you. It was a joke. Sophia, it was a prank. I knew let me see the outfit you're wearing. Hey, Mike. Can you, why are you tripping right now? I'm wearing a skirt and a shirt, who cares? It was a prank. It was a what? I'm getting pulled over, I gotta go. Okay, all right, sorry Mike, sorry to bother you. It was a prank, exactly. Oh, okay. It so was a prank? Her having another guy over and drinking? How is that a prank? That is so dumb. Stupid. You knew I had a ring doorbell. Yes, I knew you had a ring doorbell. Of course I do. You know how stupid you sound right now? No, I don't sound stupid. I'm just trying to explain. First You're of all, hanging out. Stop. You're Stop hanging out drinking. with one of my friends. This obviously did not Ooh. go out. You're hanging out with one of my friends in the house drinking, He's our shooting friend. pool, He's our looking friend. through a telescope, and you told me you were going with your girls tonight. Our Sophia, friend. what does that mean? You drinking and not answering my phone calls and hanging out with coffee. him? I was okay. drinking coffee. I if you think I'm stupid, you're done, bro. It's a prank. You're done. We're done. It's, it's everything. Prank. What do you mean it's a prank? I don't think you're stupid, but I think you're being like over dramatic right now. You seem so heated over a joke. Let me ask you a question. What if I didn't come home and I didn't look at the ring doorbell? Would it still be a prank? No, because you wouldn't have seen it. So you're just hanging out with a guy and then just kick it? She's a runner. She's a track star. No, because then I would have told you. Wait, hey. let me see what you're wearing. Let me see. Uh, yeah, it's part of the prank. Like This outfit's a part of the prank? Yeah. You sound stupid. So do you. All right, well, let me, let me <laughs> tell you something right now. So I'm going to go out, and I'm going to go prank you. Oh, okay. That's if I come home with another girl, and she's pregnant. Not only did she cheat, but right after- Bro, what? She cheated with this man's friend and said it was just a prank and then said if he wouldn't have caught her, would it still would it still have been a- blah, 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 blah. Would it still have been a prank? And she said, no, my, wow. What's going on here? Yep, you know exactly Tell me what's going on. Who's this guy? That's not your husband, right? No. I'm James. I'm the, I was the best man. This oh. is Nina. This is my best friend's okay. wife. That's excellent. Props mm. to the best man for figuring this one out. Ho yeah, props to him. Good lord, bruv. That is brutal. Golly. Like on the wedding night? On a Monday and on a Tuesday, say, that's the past. You know me. We've been through thick and thin. I don't care no, if you we were having not. a house you party. You left at thick. No, we no, didn't I didn't leave no, at no, thick. No, no. You <laughs> left at thick. Shots fired. That's a good one. No, I did not leave at you thick. thick. You know don't I did not leave at thick. You know I didn't. Don't, don't do that. Don't thing. do that before you sitting your mama on his couch. Don't you dare. Don't you dare right now. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you not dare tell me that I left that thick. You did. You're wrong. No. Wait, don't you dare. Don't you not dare. Which one is it? <laughs> do you want me to dare or not dare? I'm not a you runner. Ran. No, I have to do and it so you, you can figure She's a runner. She's a track star. <laughs> I love it. Damn. Better. No, I'm well, not running. You. Don't I'm you dare. Now. I appreciate it. Don't you it. dare. Thank yeah, that's you. why you're doing well. Because I had to do what I had to do, whether it hurt me or not, for you to be fine thank and you. be sitting on this couch alive. Y'all don't even want to thank you from you. Dang. So this was his ex who did him. What's she so mad about? Shardy, calm down. Calm down, Shardy. My Joe, words. I, I don't right. want you at my I, mother. Best, I mean, my was such a mom here, and she knows that I was there, and she knows that I had to get up and go just so and you, you could be cry. who you are right I don't now. Go on guilt You're just a. Oh, I, I cannot believe you. I know.
this is such a tough relation. I mean, Joe Budden's winning right now, though. He's got the Joe Budden network. He's got his new girl. Seems like he dodged a bullet on that one, chat. I'm gonna keep it a buck. So we everybody know what's going on. Tell them what you tell me. First cousin? Tell them what you tell me. Are they me. from Alabama? Keeping it in the family. I slept with your cousin. So no, speak up. So I they can slept hear you. with your cousin. Oh. Uh, but wait, there's more. How long y'all been sleeping together though? Four years. For a year? Yes, okay. And how long how long have we I been together? You that before you can put the camera on. How long have we been together? For eight years. Eight years, okay? And she sleep and go creep on me with my cousin behind my back. You not okay. Like, my oh thing my. is it's not oh. just my fault. You making it seem like you do your job. You're not even doing your job as a boyfriend. You don't even treat me right. I don't even feel good. He's right. Oh so my god. Mean? Listen, y'all. The way you feel ain't got nothing to do with me. That's why they call it self-esteem. How am I messing up the way you feel about your freaking self, dummy? Stupid. All I do is person? work, pay bills, come home, and make sure I try to satisfy her. You don't. No, I don't. Do that, you like I take her on on dates. We go do stuff, all, right. the, all that good. We do all of that. And the audacity to go behind my back and what? sleep. On social media for what? And sleep with my cousin. That ain't nobody's business, but I told you that. And, and I owned up to you and told you that, though. I told you. I didn't, I didn't lie to care. you. I don't care. It's owning up. You gotta take. I own. owned up to it. You should forgive me. <laughs> At least I was being honest. <laughs> it's like somebody rear-ending your car and telling you about it. Hey, man, sorry I totaled your car. My bad. My bad, man. No, you still totaled my car, dude. Owning up too. I'm owning up and putting on social media so everybody can know how. This. And on right. top of that, right. so so you can't take me to court on no type of no on no type of no. You know, domestic. I don't know what's worse, brother or. Yikes. Keeping it in the family, that's brutal. Was saying you're not Zaylee's father. Your Honor, I believe it's just out of pure hatred. She just doesn't want me to have visitation. Uh, I drive 100 and about 60 miles every other weekend just to pick up my daughter and drop her Good off. Man. He loves his daughter, but you don't want him to have the visitation. Is that true? Yes, Your Honor. Mr. Rasmussen, you Big bag. are not the father. <laughs> Miss yeah. Miller. Be respectful. I'm sorry. Miss Miller. I'm sorry. Yes. That's a lot of nerve considering the alternative is somebody that don't want nothing to do with you or your child. You just showed me where your priorities were right there. Because I held out hope that you weren't just acting a fool because you so mad at him because he cheated on you that you would cheat your child out of a father. But that cheering you did. What you cheering? I'm a single mother with nobody that loves me on my child. What you cheering for? I can't believe she started. Let her cook. Now you're a single mom. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. The alarming statistics that show how bad it is to be raised in a single mother household. Fatherless homes produce most of the degeneracy in this world. It's sad. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Oh, she cheating, she cheating. Oh, she's 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 sleeping. Sleeping. We call this Kool Aiding. Oh, oh, yeah. So we rubbing our toes. Oh, he rubbing feet. That's what we doing? That's what we doing? Oh. That's what we doing, my man. Where you going? That's what we doing? Huh? That's a oh, you stuck. You stuck now, huh? You think I'm stupid, huh? <laughs> you think I'm she what? hit him with the. <laughs> if I freeze, he can't speak to me. <laughs> my What's up? Talk to me. What's this? Oh, so you can't, you mute now. Now you to turn to a mute. Let the whole Ooh. world see it. That's brutal. Uh, yeah, there you go. What's up? Talk to me. What's this? What's this? Oh, you can't talk? You can't talk now? Really? Wow. You Man. can't talk. So he, he didn't abandon you. You can't talk now? She's huh? cooked. Huh? Now, nah, my man, come get back on them toes. <laughs> no, you get back on them toes. So you by the pool, so you at work, though. Know? Yeah, work though. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, work how did you even know I was here? Baby girl, I got your location. I air tagged your butthole. <laughs> work? This what you're doing at work? So, so if I'm at work, you got, you, toilet, you got the toilet because you got the toes in the water. It's what you're doing at work? If I'm at work, huh? how did you know oh, I'm at work? Come back over here. Come back over here, man. So why are you not at work? Huh? Are you recording me? Five years. You Five me? years though. Wow. Remember this ring you got? She really tried to put that's it on. That's crazy work. Chat, that's what you gotta do. You gotta air tag her butthole. <laughs> you just gotta. Slip that little air tag in there. You'll always know where your shardy is, bruv. No. 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 
Bro, this is why I say women are children. Who cries like this? This is what you cry like this after you fell out of the swing when you're a kid, bro. No, 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 please, please, please. What do you no. want me to do? No, what do you want me to do? I don't need this. Get just please, leave me. Just no. go. I don't know what I can do to make you better. Like, where do I go from no, here to make it better? I don't understand. So. Please, you need to. You're killing me, John. You're killing me. You're killing me. <laughs> Holding you accountable is killing you. Loki, you want to be a turkey? Free. Sit. Wait. Free. Go to your place. That's why I say accountability is a plague to these women, bro. They grow old, they never grow up. What is going on? She's crying hysterically. <laughs> Don't record me, please. Anything but record me. <laughs> you got caught. You got caught red-handed, bruv. Like, come on. Give it up. It's over. It's a wrap. Do it. Are you seriously cheating on me with my dad? Are you seriously cheating on me with my dad? You're a scumbag. Are you serious? What is this, about money? the dad. It's always about money. Guys, in a restaurant, don't do that. Son, you know, son, just calm down, right? <laughs> I'm just beating her cheeks a little bit. I don't really need you to get it. Your mama left years ago, and I, you know. <laughs> Can you imagine? My dad smokes meth. <laughs> if my dad stole my girl, I deserved it, bro. <laughs> this is crazy. He lost all his money in the stock market, right? You know, he lost all his money in the stock market. Tell him. Tell him. Aaron is, I want Aaron is laundry out. I want to get off me. I want the win back. Get your Oh, she got the little hoochie mama shorts on too. She knew what time it was. Can you imagine sitting there and being like, uh, who ordered the chicken fajitas? <laughs> uh, the enchiladas over here. Enchiladas over here. <laughs> um, excuse me, but can I get some more salsa? <laughs> can I get a refill on this water? Another margarita, please. <laughs> Bro, that'd be so awkward seeing your dad steal your broad. Oh, that's brutal. I have a boyfriend or anything like that, right? I'm not like, uh, no, nothing like that? No. <laughs> wow. Wow. Fail. Instant and complete utter you gotta oh, she was nice. I don't care how she's gonna try to spin it or what excuse she's gonna make or even if she says no to going on a date with JP. Her completely denying- Is that the Lambo Urus? I'd probably hop in that too. Mark's existence constitutes an instant fail. I know she was just blatantly just lying like that. Like, I don't have a boyfriend. Like, now I'm thinking like, was she out there just not having a boyfriend? I feel like I should have asked that like five minutes yeah. ago, but yeah. Uh, well, yeah, if you don't have a boyfriend or anything, is that like something that you would want to do? What? Yeah? Yeah. I don't really want to watch it anymore. That's cool. Because now I'm just running through back in my head, like, what was she doing at the festival? What did she be doing at these shoots? She's <laughs> not yours. It's just your turn, buddy boy. <laughs> at these shoots, guys are shooting. And I'm not talking about their shot. That well, just actually, makes... you could call it a shot. <laughs> It's hard for me to just like trust people out here. Whenever you want us to go down there, remember just bring up the cameras, bring up the fact that this is only recorded. Oh man, she's cooked. Consider her cooked. Hold on. Uh, yeah, you can just come in. It should be open. You're good, boss. My guy. Oh, he's here. Oh man, man of the hour finally came up. What's okay. good, bro? Mark. Grace, Grace, Mark, I'm actually, I'm gonna use the bathroom. My house is your house. Uh, do whatever you need to do. I'll be over here. I'll be back in like 10 minutes, less. Right. Appreciate it. Of course. It's a nice house. Uh, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? I'm here to take photos. Take photos of what? You're not a photographer. I'm a photographer today. You're a photographer today. Today I'm a photographer, yes. Okay. So you wanna tell me what y'all were just talking about? Uh, about work. He hired me for this job. Okay. And we were waiting for a photographer who was not you to get here. Hmm. And this. Bro, this, she's coming up with these lies on the spot. I gotta commend her. Nothing else. No. Nope. Sure, there's nothing else you want to tell me. I'm sure there's nothing else I want to tell you. Grace, mm. I'll give you a chance to come clean if you just tell me the truth. There's, there's nothing to tell you. What are you Grace, talking? you're lying in my. 
Face. Would you like me to tell you? You didn't just tell that man you were single and that you're able to go on a date with him. No, I didn't say that. We were talking about work. Oh my I was God, are you? Are, are we doing this right now? I'm asking the same question. She was just shocked when she got caught cheating. Bro, she's cooked. <laughs> Honey, what are you talking about? You're absolutely cooked. You got caught red-handed, bro. <laughs> what are you talking about? You are straight cooked. <laughs> the fact that she's just not even like trying to give up on it. She's like willing to die on that hill. I'm like, honey, it's a wrap. He knows everything that just happened. Are you serious right now? Loki. Can we not lick the undergrundle, please? We have people watching. Thank you. Let's get to this clip. Trying to hide it. Oh, he's FaceTiming her. Oh. You caught. Got caught red-handed, honey. You sure enough did. Man, that's crazy work. Have you guys ever been cheated on? I've never been cheated on. But I always kind of understood, even in college, that, like, women are going to be promiscuous. It was just kind of understood. Like, yeah, you could date a girl. But I always, like, would tell girls, like, I'm going to date. I always told girls, I'm going to date other people. We can we can say we're together, but I'm going to be in an open relationship. I'm going to go smash other girls. Just because I knew, I was like, as soon as I get close to a girl, I'm going to get burnt. I'm going to get burnt. Actually, I lied. I got cheated on in high school. I got cheated on in high school. Um, and, and, dude, when you get cheated on, you know how it feels, man. It's brutal. It's awful. Because you're like, why didn't you just tell me? But I didn't catch her or anything like that. I feel like it probably would have been worse. Um, but yeah, ever since then, bro, in college, I was like, bro, never. I will never get close enough to a woman again to let her do something like that to me. But look at me. Now I'm in a relationship again. Um, but me and Cass built it on a, a little bit of a different foundation. We were together for like seven years. You know, these other girls were like three months, six months. It's a whole lot different. And we've communicated and talked about things. And it's not like we just jumped willy-nilly. Like, oh, six months, we're married. Oh. Like, that to me is dumb. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Go cop the ebook, The Four Pillars of Personality Makes You Irresistible to Women and Respected by Men. I'll see you guys tomorrow, man. Peace.